Hey guys, welcome back to another how-to video. This one's actually a pretty kind of disgusting video. It's about how to get rid of your roach infestation if you have some. Um, there are three items that you are going to need. You're going to want to pick up a bottle of apple juice. The brand does not matter. As long as it's apple juice, I picked this one up from the 99 cent store. I do not know what attracts them to it, but um, they end up in the glass as soon as you put it down, like the second day or the first. You might not see them the first day, but the second day, you're gonna start seeing a couple of them in the glass, or a lot of them in the glass. Uh, second thing, second item you are going to need is duct tape. Make sure it's the 3M brand, or as long as it's really sticky. You could actually go for the Gorilla brand as well, but that one's about $15, the other one is $6. Um, but yeah, third item you are going to need is glass cups. Uh, you're going to want to set the glass cups all around, either by the fridge area or wherever you see the roaches coming out from. Uh, but you want to clean the inside of the club crystal clear, 100% clean from the inside. You got to wipe it from the inside, you got to wipe it down. The outside, you don't wipe it down, you kind of just want to leave it kind of wet and let it dry out. Or, or kind of put your fingerprints all over it uh, so the roaches are able to climb up in it and uh, as soon as they get to the top they're just gonna end up falling because they won't have no grip uh, so they'll end up falling or and then end up drowning or whatever it happens to them uh, when they fall in there uh, the only reason I'm asking you guys to say to use a glass cup is because I tried it with this mug and this is what happened uh, they do not uh, fall in the glass they actually just I have a pretty good grip in there and um, yeah it will it will not work with a with a mug so yeah and another thing is if you guys are gonna do this try it at your own risk make sure if you have kids around make sure you pick up the glasses in the morning if you're gonna be setting them up at nighttime which is more convenient but anyways once you do that uh, you're gonna want to fill up the glass cup halfway or less than halfway but preferably a little a little bit halfway or a little bit less than half preferably um, then the second thing is you're gonna want to clean up your kitchen once you clean up your kitchen you don't you want to kind of leave the sink a little bit dirty to attract the roaches and then you put in your duct tape all around it like you see here um, you put the duct tape all around the sink in a circular mode uh, and you want to kind of keep your sink a little bit dirty, food, uh, a couple few dishes, and all that. But you you do not want to cook during this. And if you do have to cook, then make sure you clean up right after. You do not want to leave a mess because if you leave a mess, they're gonna, they're gonna not end up going into the sink, and they're gonna keep on eating on the dirty areas. Uh, so you want to keep your kitchen 100% clean and just keep all the dirty stuff in the sink. And this will get rid of your problem, your roach problem, I promise you. Um, so this is the first tape with a few roaches already on them, stuck on it. Uh, as you can see, I added a corn dog, a bone, and what else? And a dirty plate. And it just attracts them to them. Like uh, The big roaches are attracted to oil. And the little ones are attracted to the apple juice mostly for some reason, I'm not sure why. Um, so then this, the second one, oh this is the cup, the first cup. So I think the apple juice evaporates or something because you know water, if you leave water it was not gonna, it's not gonna evaporate that quick. Apple juice evaporated or it was gone like within the first three days. Um, so I don't know what what happens with the apple juice. Anyways, uh, right here, I, this is the second one. I already replaced the other tape, the old tape, and I added a new one, as well as the glass cup of juice. As you can see, it's a lot more fuller. It's full of those babies or whatever you call them, and that's what you want to get. That's what you want to get rid of, because without the babies, there is no future for the rest of the roaches. Ha ha ha. Anyways, guys, um, hopefully you guys like this video, and it help it will help you out. Let me know your comments if it did, or if you have any questions down below. 
and um, like always make sure to subscribe and hit that like button and subscribe for more how-to and tech videos.